Hey guys, welcome to Deep South. Today we are trying our pork patties that I um, canned a couple of weeks ago. You can see all the grease and stuff stayed in it. Somebody did give me a tip that once they sealed, flip them upside down and let all that grease and stuff run to the top, let it cool, and then flip it up and your top patties wouldn't have be exposed, I guess. They would have the grease on top. So we're gonna open these. I've got my griddle hot and we're gonna try this because I have some pancakes that I just made and I wanna know what the patties taste like and is this something I will do over and over again. Okay, it smells good. I'm looking at it, it looks okay. The patties that are on the top are not in the oil or the grease. So the suggestion of flipping it upside down and letting it come to the top would be great, but they have grease on them. So we're gonna be okay. We're gonna put them on the griddle. And I'm gonna see if I can get all these out and put them on the griddle, see what they taste like. And they stayed in the patties. All right, this jar held five patties, and you can see like breakfast patties. That's the way I made them. Another suggestion was taking your wide mouth ring and using it like a cookie cutter and making them that size. And then once you uh, fry them just a little bit, they shrink down enough that they fit perfectly in the jar. So there's a couple of suggestions that will help in the future. They were already brown, so let me show you what they look like on the griddle. I'm just heating them through, and then we're going to fry them. These heated up really well. I'm gonna get Danny in here in a minute to try it. I heard a lot of people say that the taste was not something they liked after it was different. Um, I guess the texture that would be different when we did ground beef, the, there was a different texture. And the way this meat is, it, the texture's different, but the taste is not that much different. Still tastes like sausage. Um, like I said, the texture is a touch different, but this is awesome. To have patties ready for us to eat, I think this would be a great thing. So let me get Danny in here and let him try them. Okay, guys, we're going to try it. What you think? The taste is the same. Mm -hmm. uh, there's a difference in the texture of the meat. More like a, uh, if you've ever been to, I mean, it's been years for me, but if you've ever been to Taco Bell and eat the Taco Bell meat, uh, that's, it's kind of like that, that, you know what it reminds me of? You remember the uh, sausage that we got when we were kids? Prairie Belt or something? Uh, the original sausage in a yeah. can. Mom used to get like a gallon can of them things and Daddy would cook them up. Yeah. And so I guess the texture's like that. Um, mm -hmm. But the taste is awesome. Taste is perfect. So for a quick, already done meal, this is the way to do pork, guys. Make you some patties, throw them in a jar, pour, pour some of your oil over it or whatever's left over the grease from it. You rendered grease out of it, yeah. And process it an hour and a half. It's awesome. Awesome. So thank you guys from Deep South Homestead. Try using sausage patties in a jar.